India is already starting to seize the benefits of this low carbon economy transition. It's the renewable energy sector's fourth most attractive market in the world. And India has set impressive 2030 commitments, including the 450 gigawatt goal. And as COP presidents, we've been encouraging all countries to capture this sort of progress in an NDC ahead of COP26. Each of these important areas align very closely with the climate group's own excellent initiatives, RE100, EP100 and EV100. And I congratulate those companies here who've already joined these initiatives, demonstrating your leadership on climate. By joining these programmes, you'll be demonstrating to governments at all levels in India that there is a strong private sector demand for climate action and that you see green as something that is driving growth rather than holding it back.